gentlemen, please join me in welcoming to the stage, Mr. Robert Wilson. We are so delighted that you're here, Bob, at SCAD for Define Art. The breadth of your work spans lectures and theater, exhibitions, and it touches on so many disciplines that we also teach here at SCAD. Amazing what's happening here on your campuses. I grew up in Waco, Texas. Something I did not enjoy doing was going hunting with my father and his friends. But I could spend all day alone. I could sit there and occasionally would see a deer. He was still and I was still and if I would move, he would leave, run away. So this was something that has been with me throughout my life and is a part of my childhood, part of my personality, actually even an influence on my work as a theater director, the stillness and like an animal. Concept of stillness. At SCAD, all of our students study art history as part of their core curriculum and I know the art history has influenced your work in important mm -hmm. ways. It has. I have a, a cultural center, the Watermill Center in Long Island that I established, the Cultural Center for Creative Thinking, that we live with awareness of what man's done in the past. If we don't, we lose our memory. Lighting and sound are also part of your work and very integral and architecture. Are you a conductor choosing your instruments? Well, I start with light. That's the most important. Without light, there's no space. Light was not done two weeks before we opened. It was architectural. It was structural. It was a part of the book from the very beginning. I have a very strict architectural structure, but once you're in that structure, you have a certain freedom. Mm -hmm. The first time you ride a bicycle is a little awkward, maybe you fall over. But after a while, you can ride the bicycle without thinking about it. The more mechanical we become, the freer we are. That's what my work is like. The freedom comes from practice and from being mechanical, in a sense. Fascinating. You speak about asking questions but not knowing the answers. How do you cultivate that comfort with ambiguity? I am superficial <laughs> Bugs Bunny from Texas. <laughs> And I didn't want a reason to do what I'm doing, I just do it. But my work is different. I've never thought of my work as something that would be here in the future. And look at the 60s, the happenings by artists and art galleries. We performed in the street, we performed in parking garages and rooftops. You know, you're going to a, an event that's never gonna happen again. It's like a shooting star. Non-replicable. Exactly. So you experience something and that makes it special. Just yeah. like your performance and lecture today for mm -hmm. the students, you know, they will never forget that. It's mm -hmm. magnificent. Thank mm -hmm. you. Thank you, Bob. Thank you. <laughs>